Hello, my name is Devij. I'm a banker here in Singapore. For over 12 years, I had been suffering from migraine attacks. These had started from my late teens and had gone up into my early 30s. Uh, I would get these attacks for about two to three weeks in a row, constant migraine after migraine. And then they would kind of disappear for three, four, five, six months. And then I would go through that another cycle. And at the beginning, it was something that was fairly manageable. But as I got older, I just started noticing that the migraines were beginning to get worse and worse. In my 30s, they were particularly disruptive. But it got to the point that when I would get those migraine attacks, unless I took extremely strong medication, extremely strong painkillers, I would be laid out flat. So Monday to Friday to kind of get through the work week, I would be taking a lot of medication. It's not something anyone should be doing so often, but that was the only way that I was able to get through work. And then come the weekend, I was just completely crippled. I would be in a dark room, lying down, trying to cover my eyes, very sensitive to light, uh, because I didn't want to be taking so much medication. At work, I'm heavily medicated, but I always felt that I was off my game. I was never at peak performance because I was always being held back, at least for three weeks at a time. And the next three to four months, things would start improving, and then it would be like reset back again the next time the migraine attack would occur. So it got very disruptive. Especially on the weekends when I'm trying not to take any medication, I was completely disconnected for the family on the two days that I did have with them. So uh, it was really impacting me on, on, on both fronts, at, at home and at office. And uh, conventional medicine uh, didn't have uh, any impact. Uh, a couple of massages I tried didn't have any impact. I was very much approaching the low point uh, for myself professionally and personally. So at this point in time, my wife wanted to, uh, to to basically take matters into her own hands because obviously what I was doing was not having any uh, sustainable uh, benefits uh, to my migraine attacks. Now she had read up, read up and heard about Pankaj and about some of the amazing work that he had done. I was very skeptical. Uh, this is not something uh, that I necessarily uh, believe or prescribe to ever in the past uh, up to that point and but the thing is the way I looked at it is whatever I was doing was not working I had nothing to lose so I went went for it and I agreed to take that uh, appointment with him my, my very first impression was Pankaj was able to put me into ease straight away um, he was very intuitive in understanding some of the situations and aches and pains that I'm going through I say with confidence that next one hour with Pankaj changed my life. With the Pankaj method, I felt deeply relaxed. I felt extremely safe and comfortable. In fact, I was comfortable enough to actually open up to a complete stranger because uh, he inspired that level of trust and confidence. And at the end of that first session, I remember when I got home and I knocked on the door, my wife opened the front door and saw me. Her first expression was, why are you floating? I said, what do you mean? She's like, you have the aura of someone who's floating three inches off the ground. I had finally come across to be so light, so relaxed and, and de-stressed after God knows how many months. And it was metaphorically like a feeling of flying. So I finished another three sessions with Pankaj where he worked very closely with me to go really in depth uh, using his Pankaj method. And uh, those four sessions that I had in total with him over the course of that week were truly transformational because since, since then, and I'm talking about now, it's been 2013, it's been over eight years, uh, I have not had those kind of migraine attacks, not, not once. Those 
attacks where I would get migraines for three weeks in a row and then be completely crippled uh, and just to have it return a few months later. That one week has been so transformational in my life. But in the, in, in the time since then, I felt completely liberated. There's been that load off my mind because I've not been carrying around this constant worry about these migraine attacks going to come in again and impact me at work or again impact me at home. And when one is not bogged down with that, it means that when I'm with my family, I'm completely present with them. I'd say my relationship with the family over the last eight years or since that moment has been able to just build and get better and better, not only with my wife, but also with my kids at such formative years of their development. So it's been very important to me to be completely free of the migraines over there. And from the work front, without again being weighed down by the, the same uh, migraine fears, pressures and the migraine itself, I've been completely liberated. It's been like a dog left off, uh, taken off its collar and allowed, uh, allowed to run. The stagnancy that I had been facing for maybe a seven year period uh, in, in my work suddenly, uh, suddenly transformed itself. I mean, I, I went through a period where uh, over an 18 month stint, I had multiple promotions and it was almost effortless. I was just able to enjoy the ride. So it's helped me in my career. It's helped me in the way I conduct myself at work. It's been eight years since that moment. It's a lot of time, but it took one week with Pankaj. And the impact of that week has changed my life. So thank you, Pankaj. Thank you.